Welcome back to Meet Me in the Basement. Today we're taking an in-depth look into Sean Woodson's dominant TKO win over Colin Anglin. Sean Woodson is a featherweight who made his way into the UFC on Dana White's Tuesday Night Contender Series with a flying knee knockout win over Terrence McKinney. He's since gone three of four in the promotion with his only loss coming via submission by Darce Choke to Julian Arosa in June. At six foot two with a 78 inch reach, Sean is likely the biggest height and reach advantage over anyone in the featherweight division. As soon as Sean and Colin stepped into the cage, the size difference was obvious. Let's be honest, with Colin Anglin landing only 8 strikes total to Woodson's 59 total strikes, Dominant doesn't even begin to describe it. There are two main takeaways here. Sean Woodson's incredible boxing ability and his newly shown off defense grappling, with Sean easily stuffing Anglin's takedown attempt, digging underhooks, reversing position, and returning to striking range. Sean was picking Anglin apart from the outside. His ability to mix up, going to the body repeatedly and landing straight right punches, switching stance through the punch and following up into southpaw. Colin Anglin couldn't find his range because Sean Woodson was constantly showing different looks as well as mixing up his shot selection, keeping Anglin guessing. Colin Anglin was able to capitalize with a few big punches by catching Sean after his combinations when Sean remained in the pocket a little too long. These successful strikes were few and far between, however, with Sean able to eat the few they got through with no problem. Woodson then landed a big body knee, a few of them actually, uh, followed by body hooks to the, uh, against the cage. Woodson immediately recognized Anglin was hurt to the body, going as far as to shake his finger at Colin after a particularly harsh liver shot got a big reaction from Colin Anglin. From there it was over. Woodson throws four to five more big hooks to the body and liver that drop Colin Anglin, forcing the referee to step in and end the fight.